Hi guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Fable 2. Alright, um, we're trying to make our way through the defense of the castle. We found our way into a crypt, kind of. Get rid of these beetles. And uh, this part can be actually difficult for one reason, because you have to do this really quick. Oops, okay. I did that wrong. Come on. Oh. Uh, to actually... Okay, that was a lot easier than I remember it being. But, whatever. It's fine by me. It looks like there should be a door there. I don't know why, it just does. Oh. Drinking the potion will alter your gender forever, but if you leave without drinking it, the potion will evaporate as you exit the tomb. You must choose now. Alright, so th during the course of the game, they actually give you an option to change your gender if you want to. I think I'm actually going to do it because... Oh, why the heck not? <clears throat> but I'm going to get all this treasure here first. Money bag. Uh, okay, there's some more over here. Okay. Emerald. And I think this is the last one. Children's Health Potion. Alright, so. I'm gonna take this, and I'm gonna use it. Use. So I will actually be, uh... A female character now. Kind of interesting. Dun 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 dun. And I'm gonna have to get my hair cut and everything. I look a little strange, <laughs> but uh, I'll change that eventually. Right. Yay! Okay. Time to exit. Anything else? No. Don't think so. Better not be, anyways. Okay. So this brings us out at the other, um. Another crypt thingy, I guess you could call it. What are those things called? They're not mausoleums. Oh, anyways. We're in the cemetery, so. Uh, there's one thing that we need to do. I might as well just warp there. Uh, we're gonna go to Bowerstone Market to get the, um, the Gargoyle Treasure. Let's see, uh, Market. Okay, now that we're here, I'm actually going to get some haircut and such. Okay, I don't need, uh, clothing. Over here. Because now that I'm female, I don't want, like, any kind of... The what the heck? No oh, I see. So there is another, uh, clothing shop over there. Ah, uh, so the shops are just opening, so I guess I have a little bit of time. Or do I? Wait, I want to see. Can I get a different title? I want to get the king one. Always or queen, I guess, now. You. You. I or do I want the, uh... Mare? Oh, I don't... Yeah, I think I'll go with the one that I... Have, the queen, whatever. It's still not open. Hey, I didn't buy this place? Wow. Wait, I did, but it, where did the... Oh, whatever. 
the little glowing thingy isn't beside the... Oh, it's not showing up on any of them. Oh well. You know what? I should stop wasting time and just go. The shops will still be open when I exit. I'm not going that far. Oh, and there's Murgo. He has uh, another quest for us to do. Now that we've uh, finished the game as well. I'll have to do that as well. Oh, I missed it. There. Gargoyle tr Okay. Didn't take too long to load this area. Okay, so... We can go in all the remaining ones. I'm not sure, I forget which ones I've been in, but... Whatever. Been in this one. I haven't been in this one down here. Open this. Money. Okay. So I don't think there's any more on this side. Let's go back over to the other side. Yeah, we're missing one. I think it's this one Ooh, here. Oh, what is this? Cool augment. I think that's just like life drain. I did miss another one? This one over here? I guess so. Like if you attack an enemy, it'll give you life, kind of thing. No, it's this one. Emerald. 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 Oh, three emeralds. There. Okay. Now we have activated them all. And we gotta go down this way. Open this. What do we get for getting all the gargoyles? A rotten apple. One thing you never want to hear, an apple. Silence. Hear from an apple. Oh yeah, because it doesn't crunch. <laughs> what? He laughed at us. What a jerk. Actually, no, it's not. You can go behind here. Get your actual treasure. He tried to trick you. here and what do we get the rammer oh I didn't know it was worse anyways it's the ultimate crossbow in the game so I don't think he can yeah. oh well so I'm going to actually get out of here, go back to the market. Oops. Uh, yes. Okay. Look out. The shop should be open now. Yeah, good. Come here. This should be like the woman's shop. I don't know if I've buy these dyes. Hope you enjoy it. Oh, you won't regret buying that. And oh, regret buying that. clothing, why not? Yeah, see these are all the uh Yeah, female. Oh, you won't nah. get them all, I don't care if I have them. Oh, you won't regret buying that. Expensive, the 
because it's good. <laughs> yeah, whatever. That's a good buy. Good enough. Alright, now I'm going to have to get my hair and stuff done because... Well, I'm a female now. We don't want any, uh, mustache. We have to get some makeup, though. We'll go black and red, why not? I don't know. Don't want any beards either. Oh, you sold their length hair. Oh, you won't regret buying that. Maybe the long hair. That's a good buy. I'm gonna buy these dyes, because I don't know if I have them. Probably do. Oh, you won't regret buying that. Let's see, our character. She's a little butch, but uh I'll have to change my clothing and such. Alright, well I'm going to actually get not the uh <laughs> not the long hair. I don't much like it. I shall get the what was it the other one? Solder length. Yeah. Good enough. That's a good buy. There. Okay. Now let's go to see, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go. I guess we could do that. It's right down here, of course. Let's see what he has for us. Oop. Ah, there you are. My source has finally come <sighs> through. I have in my hands the item that offers visions of the future, and it's well, not quite what I was expecting. I was hoping for a nice crystal ball, or some pretty cards. Even a bucket of entrails would have been better than this. Here, you can have it. I'll never be able to sell it to anyone else. And to tell you the truth, it gives me the willies, and not the good kind. Okay, I'll take it. Spire statue. Best of luck with that. And don't let anyone know I let you have it for free. You can just imagine what that would do to my reputation. Okay, I want to see what he has. I don't think he has anything. Welcome to my cave of wonders. Yeah, he's got more makeup and... Hmm. I might want to do the, uh... This. What an extraordinary purchase. I want to see what the clothing he has. I think, uh, yeah, I got all these, I'm pretty sure. I'll get that just in case I didn't. You will be the envy of the civilized world. Anyways. Alright, so I'm going to use that uh, object. Where is it now? Is it under miscellaneous? Spire statue is what we were looking for. It looks like we're only missing eight keys, silver keys, but we'll see. Ah, there it is. Now this what I'm doing here is downloadable content, so we get to see what happens. Oh, it's Teresa. What's she doing? Here you are again. You knew you would return. I know what your question is. Yes, the Spire had a gift for me, too. The future has always whispered to me, and I have followed its sound blindly. But now I can see all possible futures. There are many threads, too many to count. Yet there are moments when they all converge, events that cannot be avoided, futures which must be fulfilled. It is time I showed you one such future. Take my hand. One last time. Okay. Let's do it. It is many years from now. A queen feels age weighing her down. 
and the responsibility of an entire kingdom. These are her men, loyal soldiers who would die for her. Many already have, on battlefields at home and in faraway lands. They would follow her wherever she leads. These are her people, subjects who worship her, who trust her to guide them, protect them and govern them. And this is her throne, Albion's seat of power, where she has made countless decisions, delivered justice and led a nation. Yet none of this is of the least importance. This is the real future. Her child, not yet born, but destined for greatness. A child on whom the fate of Albion will depend one day, as will the fate of Aurora. These things you will understand in time. For now, you must live your life and prepare for what is to come. Take care, little sparrow, and remember, I am always here, always watching. All right, for uh, going through that, we get certain uh, items: royal crown, royal robe, royal trousers, royal boots. And uh, we've completed that little quest. Didn't take too long. So we actually can put on the crown and s all that stuff. It'll be... Oh, boy. I thought we got a... Hmm. Uh, I thought we got something else. From your visit to the future. I trust it was a favorable one. Yes. You don't want to go to all that trouble to find out you're croaking it tomorrow. <laughs> I've been doing rather splendidly for myself. All thanks to you. There's no better advertising than people see you obtaining all these rare and molecular objects. My source, well, I guess you know who she is now, left one last thing for you. Something only a hero could hope to enjoy. I don't want to spoil the surprise, but have your weapon ready when you use it. Best of luck, old friend. And remember to keep shopping at Murgos. Hmm. Oh, Coliseum model, huh? Well, let's... Yeah, I'm going to stop it here. Next time we'll probably do the Coliseum model thingy. That's going to be it for this episode, guys. Godspeed, stay frosty. See ya.